<laughs> Y'all want to know a little secret? I got a Patreon. Over there is where we watch exclusive videos. You know what I'm saying? For example, we got Queendom, Kingdom, Road to Kingdom, Bon Voyage, In the Soup, DVDs, K-dramas, pretty much anything that can't go on the channel. If you want to support the channel a little bit more, go ahead over to my Patreon. Let me know what you think about it. You know what I'm saying? But if not, it's still cool. It's just, it's okay. You know? All I ask for you to do is subscribe, leave a like down below, and tell your friends about me. Um... So that's about it. Let's get back to the video. Oh my God. <laughs> so I was sent this TikTok. Well, I was sent a couple TikToks. What's going on? Okay, so I don't know if y'all are on the same side of TikTok that I'm on, but there's this new girl group that just debuted called First of All. But there's this new girl group that just debuted and their freaking group name is Coco and Butter. <laughs> Let's be fucking for real. But it's not even that. It's not even that. Their title song is called Mi De Ya. But that's not even The beginning of the song, I think Miss Girl said Wagwa. <laughs> but then again, it's not even that. The person that's featured in the song, the person's name is Kunta. Oh no! <laughs> Bitch, this is like quadruple homicide. Like, if they don't want to disband, they need to change their concept fast. There's a new group called Coco in Butter. Or if you were otherwise known as Coco Butter. If, we're, not, we're not about to act like... You know what I'm saying? We're not we're not finna we're not finna act like shit ain't really what it is. You know what I'm saying? We could we can literally just read through the lines. Their name is pretty much Cocoa Butter. You know what I'm saying? And uh I didn't know that they're from Street Woman Fighter. I didn't know that. I wasn't I wasn't aware of that. I just got hip to that. But um I mean, we're not finna act blind to everything. You know what I'm saying? We know what's going on. <laughs> I made a video about this type of topic. If you haven't seen it, y'all can go ahead and watch it and watch me ramble for like 30 minutes. However, um, I'm not going to lie. I'm very curious. I'm very curious, like very curious to see what the hell is going on. So uh, this is called, they, they have a song, of his debut. It's called Me De Ya. So we're going to watch that and I'm going to look at the profiles of this group because why? Because they can... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, bro. I don't know. I'm already anticipating some bullshit. I'm, I don't know. Let's just watch it, bro. Let's let's just let's just watch it. Y'all already know my body about like situations like this or things like this. So let's just let's just see what's gonna go on. Oh, it's auto-generated lyrics. I mean captions. Okay. All right, man. What the fuck. Let's go. I'm sorry. I forgot in the TikTok they said their first word was wagwan. I'm not gonna lie to you, this beat is hard as shit. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this beat is hard as hell. Their 
they're doing the dances too. All right. All right. Okay. What is that dance called? What is that? I forgot. I'm not, I'm not like, I don't, I'm not, I, my culture isn't like, I'm African American, not African. So I don't know the, the dance. And I'm not about to do this shit. This, this. They're doing the dances too. So. <laughs> oh my God. And plus, I don't know which region from, I don't know which region or like, wh I don't know where that's from. I don't know if it's from, I see, I'm not trying to fuck up the names. Y'all yeah, know, y'all yeah, know, I'm, I'm not trying to fuck up the names. So, yeah. Who the fuck is this nigga? See, this is why I wish there were captions. What the hell? Is he a part of that group? What is going on? Wait, okay. I'm pausing a lot. This music video, this is... I've seen this before. I've seen this backdrop before. Where is this from? Where is this backdrop from? Wait a damn minute. I've seen this before. Or am I tripping? I could be tripping. Am I tripping? They are trying their hardest to make this shit hard. Can you say that? Where do they get these drums from? Coca and butter. I'm not going to lie, bro. I feel like they really are trying to make this shit hard. Like, the song is all... Like, the, the instrumental itself is hard as the fuck. But I feel like they're trying to make this shit, like... I don't know. Y'all already know how I feel about this shit. I feel like this shit is kind of comedy. And I, I, I don't... And comedy in the sense of, like, a bad joke. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because like nigga, I don't, I don't know, bro. They was doing the dances. They said Wagwan. It's a lot of shit going on. I the only thing I'm hoping is that they actually like studied this shit, so it won't seem like they're making a joke about it. But let's run through the profile and see what this group, who this group is. Let's see what these ladies are. I still don't know who that guy was though. Who was that guy? I don't, I don't know. But let's go. Coca and butter profile and facts. Coca and butter also style as is coke and coke coke and butter, coke and butter, coke and butter. Hmm. It's a South Korean dance group under MLD Entertainment. They consist of six members: Rihe, Z Sun, Gaga, Bicky, Jillian, and B B B. They were formed in 2018, and their style is hip hop and dance hall. Okay. They gained popularity after their participation, the, the, okay, Street Woman Fighter. Coca and Butter officially debuted as a music group with their first single album called Midday uh, on October 6th. With the lineup, re okay. Fandom name, Ang Butter. Fan color. Well, you would think it would be brown, right? I guess. Okay, this is Rihe. Okay, hey. She was born in 1990. She's Aries. She's 5'3. Okay. Nationality Korean. She was born in Daegu. She has a brother and two. She's a big fan of Rihanna. Okay. Her motto is be happy. Her drinking capacity is a bottle of soju. 
She has a total of six tattoos. Okay, I really not gonna lie. I'm not even. Gonna, oh, she was a former member of Purplo. Huh. Okay. This is Z Sun. All right. She's five two. Okay. She's also a part of Purplo. Okay. Her religion is Catholicism. Baptist name, Glara or Glara. I didn't know you have Baptist names. Huh? I didn't know that. All right. Hmm. Okay. Um, Gaga. I love that name. Gaga. She's a cancer. She, they, they don't know her height and weight, huh? Okay. Because of Boa, she became interested in Japanese artists. Ooh. Oh. Oh, she was a trainer for SM? Oh, that's... Oh. Huh. Okay. That's kind of fire. I'm not going to lie. Bicky. Okay. She's also a former member of Purplo. All right. So Purplo just like, just, oh, she runs her own beauty shop? How the fuck does she have time to do that? Nigga, what? <laughs> Jilin. She works as an animal health worker. And she's also a former member of Purplo. Did Purplo just disintegrate? Like, what the hell? Like, God damn. Why couldn't y'all keep the name Purplo? <laughs> BB, y'all don't know shit about her. All right, okay. Hmm. She has a dog. Okay. Who's my bias? None of them. So I just want to know what the hell is going on. This shit is, I don't. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Korea Boo. Korea Boo is talking. Dance group, Coca and Butter, come under fire for cultural appropriation. All right. We're getting tired of this happening time after time. Yeah, no shit. Um, the unacknowledged or inappropriate adoption, the customs, practices, ideas of one people's society members simply more dominant than people's society. Unacknowledged or inappropriate adoption. That's a good, that's a good way to speak on it. I'm not going to lie. You need to gain attention. Okay. In West Africa, where more than half of the world's commercial coca is produced, and in parts of Central and South America, as well as the Caribbean countries to which they are indigenous, co 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 ah, fuck, I'm sorry, beans have been harvested to create cocoa butter. I use cocoa butter. I like cocoa butter. Cocoa butter is pretty good. Cocoa butter is really actually amazing, and like, you know, cocoa butter is lovely. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you, cuz. I'm not going to lie to you, cuz. Uh, th this is, this is honestly like a, something that's going to brew, you know what I'm saying? Dressed in ways that could be deemed as cultural appropriation and wearing head wraps. Like, I don't, this is not like, my culture is not West African. Like I'm just black, but I can still like see, like, you know, you know what I'm saying? They put in a, they put in a lot of stuff in these, in these, in these, uh, these comebacks, man. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. This ain't going to end well. In a way, African culture, yet, while it's a fashion and photo, head wraps can express marital status or age at a glance. Oof. We know about the braids thing. Oh, she, she, oh, she put on a jean jacket. Okay. All right. Um. <sighs> Many believe they were definitely using patois. They definitely were using patois. I'm not going to. And Wagwan, yeah, they get like what? They definitely reuse in patois. These the dances, like bro, like this is not gonna be. This isn't gonna end well. I'm pretty sure they're looking for that bad buzz. There's no way people keep doing it without knowing. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. This is exactly what I'm saying. Along with the name of the group and collaborating artist Kunta. So this is the motherfucker's name was Kunta. That name, nigga, name is Kunta. Oh God, it is. Oh shit! This is a this is a mess. This is a mess. Oh god, this shit is by design, my nigga. This shit is by design. I'm sorry. The name being a playoff cocoa butter and featuring an artist named Kunta is sending me like this is. <laughs> Bro, this is crazy. I this is crazy. I keep hearing my people, but not seeing my people. Jesus Christ. 
While netizens always want to educate idols and those in the Korean entertainment, it seems like it continues to occur despite many to be called out. Because they don't give a fuck. They are yet to respond to the allegations. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> no shit, brother. <laughs> no shit, brethren. <laughs> I feel as though all niggas, all we can do is laugh because they're gonna keep doing this shit. You know what I'm saying? You can just laugh and not in. I don't know. I'm already like putting putting it out there, but uh, this is not gonna lie. This is like beating a dead horse. I feel like this is this is definitely beating a dead horse. There's no way y'all niggas have a song from a group called Cocoa and Butter. Say Wagwan, do the dances and everything in the video. And still have a collaborative artist named Kunta. The concept photos. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. You can't tell me we are not living in a situ situation, a simulation. <laughs> I can't be asked. I can't be asked. I can't be asked. What do y'all think about this? Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> 